Sen de yerinde. I wanted to heal myself, and uh, through your program, I was, I am able to do that. Like I'm able to tag my thoughts and uh, uh, hope on a photo, pain body. All these things are really helping me. Uh, the old and new belief system, all that is really helpful. But one thing which comes always comes back to me is uh, the astrological predictions. For example. Uh, when the predictions are like you will not be successful as a business person, you will have to do a job. So certain predictions are always coming back. I am not able to, yes I am trying hard that okay this is my old belief system, I have to have a new belief system but somehow it is trying to pull me down. So I want your suggestions on that okay. Thank you for the question. Again another question that a lot of people can relate to. So thank you for the question. Okay, um, few things. Remember I said pain body is underneath even your negative beliefs. So if, even if that astrology prediction was not there, think of astrology prediction as just a reflection of something else. Deep down, if some aspect of us does not believe, it's going to hold on to beliefs that uh, affirm that particular aspect of us that it may not be possible for us. What have we learned is, throughout our lives, we've learned that external forces have more power than we do. In fact, it's so indrawn in society, especially in our culture, that it's like it's like the white collar syndrome. If a doctor tells you you're going to die in three days, we'll believe the doctor, and your subconscious will believe it. So astrology is a science of its own, but I have also been on that same case of being having done predictions which did not come through. I don't think any of my predictions have ever come through, ever. That's because the moment someone tells me I can't do something, I know it's a bullshit thought. I'm going to do it anyway. And that's the fun of it all is to go back to that person and say, hey, look at what I did. And Subita's case study, how many of you have heard of Subita from our, yes. Her astrological prediction was she will not live post-2020. Her lifeline was dead. She's very much alive. She's a coach and trainer today. So you have to then choose. Of course, there is a science to it. There is legitimacy. But I also believe it's like tarot cards. Your values and your energy in this moment determines what happens in the next moment, but there's only one moment. This is the only moment of power. So just remember this, remember my face, and just remind yourself that it's a great opportunity to heal the belief deep underneath that, and also an opportunity to believe. But make it fun. Let me prove this person wrong. And then it's a lot of fun, because you... See, let me t just tell you one thing right now. <coughs> Let me see that for this mic to exist. Yes, there is uh, molecules, there is atoms, there are subatomic particles. Underneath the subatomic particles, there is energy. But these particles that you're talking about, subatomic particles, they exist here because we are actually observing them. They actually come in and out of existence. We are in quantum mechanical fact. They come in and out of existence based on our intention. I'm seeing this mic here. So point is a little complex, the point being is electrons are completely vibrating on the frequency that we intend again and again and again because right now there are 10 intentions that I put out. One person version of me might think I'm not good enough to be sitting here and another version of myself that thinks I am good. So all electrons are sitting and bouncing off places, right? So I have to then keep choosing I'm good enough, I'm good enough, I'm good enough so that that form that my body, mind and my life takes is that which I the energy I'm putting out. So just remember quantum physics, also written in our own texts. So knowledge is, the power is not out there, it's always been inside. So think of it this way, the molecules are always arranging to our intention. Keep putting out that intention so it's the strongest and that is what manifests. Got it? Was that helpful? Yes. <laughs> okay, so I'm seeing a lot of beautiful faces and